left, right, left, right, left, right. Moderately disappointing. Um, so I don't know if I've mentioned this before on the vlog, but I, I suspected that my Minolta had a light leak in it. Um, pretty sure I'm right. So here's, so what I'm doing here, I'm gonna import <clears throat> I'm gonna import the uh, two rolls of film that I got back when wow they do not know how to spell my name at all so right here it's not a great example I'll find a good example so like one roll is fine and then the other roll is like you know astronomically ruined so this is a light leak this little orange strip down the left side of the frame right here. Problem becomes when it gets left too long, it turns into something like this, which obviously completely ruins a shot. Is this in focus? I need you to focus. So what we're gonna do is go through the photos. So I've got 63 approximate photos that we're gonna go through right now. So here's another great example. Uh, this is a photograph of a woman doing something called Reiki, which is energetic healing. Um, but, as you can see, the obnoxious bottom of the frame, the left frame, left, left side of the frame of the camera, is letting in all this light, so it ends up looking blown out. Um, for some of these photos, it's salvageable, like this one. For others, it's completely not. So I'm going to have to take my camera in to get repaired which bums me out immensely. It was my 29th birthday last week, so this was a, the cake that my mom made for me. A father-daughter walking down the street. Um, I didn't get the separation between them that I wanted. They were walking like hand in hand, but then he kind of cut it in front of her because they were cutting down this parking lot. So the shot didn't end up turning out the way I wanted it to. Same with this. Uh, this woman had an incredibly colorful keychain. And I thought I was pretty close. Obviously, you don't want to get obnoxiously close in instances like that. You can easily start conflicts. So, didn't get the shot there either. Didn't turn out the way I wanted it to. This one, what I had saw when I took the shot was the red fire equipment behind him. Red shoes, red hat, red shirt, red coffee cup, red in that. I still quasi like this. There's that light leak again. So that's not too bad. We'll add that to the quick collection. Uh, again, this woman had incredibly colorful uh, gloves, and it matched the sign, but when I went to take the picture, she hid them, which is obviously problematic. No good. That's a monkey. I'm going to add that. There's the light leak again on the bottom. Oh, there's a better shot of the monkey. Uh, light leak. This was the shot that I mentioned in the vlog um, where the guy was looking at me funny. I mentioned the red flag in a sea of black and white. A client of mine working his dog. Another client of mine working her dog. Both good shots. Take them. Woman under a Lululemon sign. Like that one. This guy hiding in a corner. Uh, took two shots of this. I just remember taking the, the two shots. So I'm not taking that one. I'm going to take the other one. That didn't end up turning out. There's the light leak again. My dog on a very cloudy road. My niece. Eh. I don't not like that shot. I won't delete it, but... It's my, uh, you guys remember uh, Dr. Tracy Lynn that I followed around? That's her daughter. Client of mine. I'm going to save that. I'm going to have to crop it because I think the negative kind of converged in on the other one. Client dog, client dog, client dog. Ironic. That was from the location challenge that I did on my Instagram story. 
for any of you who watched that. This, this was the shot. This was the shot that I wished, turn, I, I was hoping that turned out, this is it. I love this picture. It is exactly how I wanted it to turn out. The birds, the cross, the birds in flight, the color, the juxtaposition, I just love it. There's, this is a great photo. I love this photo. Uh, similar one, but again, only one bird's flying, and you got that stupid light leak. So, uh, another one with client. Oh, better add that to the quick collection. I'm going to add that too, see if I can crop that out, because that's actually kind of a cool photo too. Same idea, but only one bird is flying. I'll think about that one. Client and her dog, client and her dog, client and his dog. Uh, tried to get this long border, didn't really work out. Cute little chihuahua that was on the street. I was intrigued by the shadows and the lines of these shoes, but it just didn't end up turning out the way I wanted it to. So, skip. That was the one that I was going to take. This knitted football jersey is just awesome. This one was kind of interesting too. Caught one bird in flight coming off that same area. I'm standing on top of a outdoor parking lot for this shot though. This one was really neat. It, uh, the light shining down on the church here. I think I got another shot like that later. Let's get rid of that one. Ah, that's the wrong one. That one we can delete from disk. Here's where it gets bad, right? This this is the light leak again. I'm super bummed that I'm gonna have to send my camera in for repair because I really like shooting film. And it's just, I just, yeah. didn't turn out that I wanted it to. This guy was cleaning off graffiti. I think that day I just hadn't shot much of anything and I just wanted to take a picture. There's the light leak again. And I was trying to get this woman's hand out because it was a very colorful glove, but didn't turn out. I'm having to throw away a lot of these shots. There's the light leak again. I liked the color on this bike, but the light leak is taking away from the offset color that was on the rim. It was kind of an orangey color on the rim, but because of the light leak, it just ends up looking like a piece of crap shot of a bike. This was written on somebody's window. Thought it was pretty funny. I'm gonna keep it, light leak and all. Horrendously messed up. The car screwed up the shot anyways. I wanted all three of them with the empty street and this car kind of cut in on the shot. Light leak, trash, light leak, trash, light leak, trash. My wife, my son, uh, my niece coloring again. I'm gonna keep that one because there's no light leak and it's a good shot. A lot of snow, more snow, cat. Out of focus dog. Out of focus dog. There's a good one. Keep that. It's an old client of mine. We had a follow up session the other day. And keep that one. So our quick collection looks something like this. I think there's some extras from the last. Yeah, so a couple from the previous vlog, I believe. That one, two, that one. Get out. All right. So now we have a collection of images here that uh, 27 images out of 36, 46, 56, 58, about 62 possible pictures, 27 that I'm going to further develop and a couple that I'm going to post. Not a bad keeper rate. These, I'll show you the pictures that I'm super excited about. So that picture I'm super excited about. I really like that picture. It's very simplistic. It it resembles a lot of the uh, the negative space stuff that I'm doing that I'm really interested in right now. There we go. Um, so I'm, I like that picture. Uh, cha cha. This one I don't mind. It's not in my favorites, but I I kind of like it. Um, this one of Loki I like. Again, playing into that negative space theme that I've been really loving lately. Uh, favorite from the role is probably this one. I really, really like this picture. It's got a lot of complexities to it. It's got, I just like it. It's a really great shot. I think I'm going to get it. The, the, only, the only unfortunate part about it is I am going to have to crop it ever so slightly 
and this is why. This, just this little bit down here, it's a good shot, so the crop isn't gonna take a lot away from it. I'm not losing any details. I j I'm just moderately, uh, there's a purist side of me that really doesn't want to crop anything. Sorry, this won't stay in focus today. I don't know what the hell's going on with it. But this is this is by far like the the picture that I wanted from the roll. This is the one that I'm most happy with. All right, now I gotta go take this in to get fixed. Shit, that bums me out. Oh well. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Kind of a I don't know if it's gonna be a short one or not, but yeah, that's a good shot.